this is the face of somebody that's just got tickets for this stomping off-road adventure. I've literally just done a little dancing jig around the shop. I'm so excited. It is not included in the park admission. It's $15 per person plus tax, but I can guarantee it's going to be worth it. I cannot wait. Um, it looks like there's three different trucks that go out. I'm just going to quickly flip the camera around and show you. So you've got Cannibal Jake, Swamp Ghost, and the Bone Crusher. Harry wants to go on Cannibal Jake. I want to go on the Bone Crusher. I'm not sure Neil's got a preference, to be honest, but the art looks really cool. I like that one, it looks really funky. Buggy tour that operated here. We've quietly driven out those great simple folks who ran that tour and turned the ride into a mind-numbing experience like you've never had. So join us on our delightfully dreary tour of real Florida featuring stereotypical cartoon critters from around the world. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. How y'all doing? Good. Are you folks ready to have some fun? Yeah. All right, I like that energy, guys. Oh, yeah, Did he just say penguins? What is this, world? Florida, I'm pretty sure they have felt. What's this guy In talking Florida, about, Kevin? Real Florida. There's the guy. Hard bark, okay. Uh, that guy's not wearing Chelsea pants. The guys, what is a chameleon? Is oh. that a chameleon? Welcome. Yeah. Yeah. This is what you guys pay for? <laughs> Eight and a half hours of the redneck version of a small world? <laughs> Cut this off, please. Guys, 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 guys. I got a little something called self-respect. I'm not going to this uh, gender reveal party gone wrong back here. I'm not going to do it. I got a better idea. I say we steal the buggy, go off-road and find us some gators. What do you guys say? Yeah. Yeah. Sound pretty good? Yeah. yeah. All right, guys. If you want to steal the buggy, can I get a big old... <laughs> no, that was good though. I like, I like the energy. Hit it, Kayla, show what it does, honey. Yeah. Folks, I don't care what you hold on. So you can hold on to stuff. It's about to get a little bumpy. Check it out. We go up. Looking like a bearded Reba McIntyre. That's a good looking guy right there. Hey, what's that stuff? This is hang on to your bridge. Oh, it says britches. <laughs> this is right over here, punch the baby once. See, me and Caleb, we got some of those special green ones out back. Don't touch those guys. Those are for uh, glaucoma. Yeah, I got the car and everything. <laughs> hey, Sad Jenny, come on. Whoa. Get her guarded to eviction notice. Notice the vacate. Okay, then they kicked him out. That's messed up. We were just here. Uh, anybody here looking for a vacation home? We got some empty lots. Yes, sir, this one over here comes with the redneck food truck. We got some outdoor plumbing for you and uh, for the yard dog. That's all white, no parking. This one over here comes with a uh, <coughs> roommate and uh, we'll throw on some for you. Get smell right out for you guys. Don't worry about that. <laughs> you know what? Just in the end, all this round. Wait, it is. We lost the whole bad girl last time. How you doing, bad girl? You guys trapped in pretty good. Hey, do you know what caddy wampus means? What? Caddy Wampus, you ever heard that term before? Oh, you're about to find out. Good first up, you got your caddy. You had a little bit of Wampus. Oh, 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 Way down in the Louisiana Bayou, 
If you stare into the piercing blue eyes of a stark white alligator, you get 10 years of good luck and good fortune. Now that sounds pretty good, right? Yeah. Well, me and Caleb, we tried that because we have some of those gators here. We went down there and looked each other's eyes all day long, but at the end of that day, we still work here, guys. So no, not that lucky. <laughs> <laughs> hey, check it out. That right there is the ex-girlfriend, well, guys, we're going to get over <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we're carrying it on with this beautiful world from Redneck Engineer. Not going to get in our way. Let's go keep us out of the way. Stop it. What in the bootleg Jurassic Park gate is this? <laughs> all right, hold on. Uh, I need, I need, all right. How you doing, buddy? Good. I need a small person. You look pretty small. All right, you, you have fun? You want to have some yeah. more fun? All right, here's yeah. the plan, man. I'm going to unbuck you. I'm going to ball you up. I'm going to eat you over that gate. You're going to swim real fast, wrestle off about 100 alligators. We're going to flip that switch for us. We're going to ride on through. We're not going to pick you up. How's that sound? Good. All right, I'm going to for next year. Hold on. All right, I got another idea. Have you folks ever heard of something called Disney Magic? No. That's good. We ain't got it, bud. It's too expensive. We got it right now. Let's try it over. Check it out. One, two, three. Clap on. Bam. <laughs> That's fancy stuff right there, guys. That's fancy like Applebee's on a date night. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that right there ain't uh, fake trust and pixie dust. We leave that to the Brat Park up the street, guys. That right there is WD-40, duct tape, and a little something we like to call the clapper. High tech stuff, guys. All right, folks, we're entering the main attraction, Swampy South Gator Pond. And I think it's beautiful. Swampy oh, Sal always did say the best Florida attraction, well besides me and Caitlin, was Florida itself. And I think these gators really do prove that, guys. <laughs> Last time we counted, we got more than 100. Sail, fresh, jaw smashing American alligators in this pond. And they get paid a lot of money to do nothing all day long. Kind of like those Kardashian girls out west. <laughs> We also got some attractions here for you guys. We got your gas and go boat right over there. Good prices there on, on, on if you want to rent that boat. Bro. Right over here, we see that moon shining for it. We saw on that side earlier. Me and Kaylin hit that up every morning. That's how she drives it so good. All right, guys, see if you can find the 12 and a half foot gator in the pond. Point him out if you see him. You're good. You're good. Anybody see him? 12 and a half feet. Point him out if you see him. That's right. That right there is Pops. He's the oldest Ooh. gator at Gatorland. He's been here since 1949. You're good on the right. He's about 12 and a half feet long. He's about 1,000 pounds. He's 73 years old. He's also a bit of a celebrity. He was in Indiana Jones, too, as part of the Gator Pit scene. He was also in the original Jurassic Park. They what? used his growl as part of the voice of the T-Rex in that movie. Oh, wow. They mixed his sounds up with some other animals, and that's how you get that T-Rex sound. You got three right here that are moving. Just get yeah, keep on the slow. He's also blind in his right eye because he can't see the haters on that side. That's right. That's right. Good luck. See this little one right here? That's my friend Allie right there. Everybody wave to Allie. Say hi, Allie. Hi, Allie. Y'all know what Allie's short for, right? Allie. Uh, no, sir, that's Allison. Why would you name it Alligator Alligator? That's weird. You call your dog Pug? Pug, you that alligator. Just give me a gander back there. If we're good all the way, give me a thumbs up. Get all the way. They keep us thinking. Are we clear? All clear. Yeah. Are you sure? Hey, man, you know what I call those things? Tailgater. Ah, <laughs> that's right. The little one. Really? That's hard to believe. What did you do to my bridge, sweetie? You fired it. Nothing. That's a lot of nothing. <laughs> well, how are we supposed to get home? What you want to do? Fire. You and me. Oh, Take all the people. Oh, you send it. Who wants to jump the bridge to get home? Yeah. If you did not raise your hand, just close your eyes. You won't see it when you hit the ground. Hit it! Woo! Woo! Yeah! I'm kidding, that guy. We need it. You got the fun, though. I like it. All right, Katie, go to hang that right, honey. Let's get these folks back on. Oh, they closed it. You know what? That's fine. We'll just go down the fire station. Where are you going, Katie? We can't go that way. Hold on, wait. Actually, that's kind of fun. Folks, put your hands up. Woo! Hey, there goes. Well, you. Give me keep right, buddy. You want to keep right, buddy. Besides, is that you? Did you hear the big news? Yep, the little one blew up the bridge. I don't even know how she did it. Back in the room, the CEO has not been arrested. The truth is that this year's swamp buggy tours are turning back to me. Oh, 
Folks, you want to thank you so much for riding the stop and Gator off road to mention here at Gator Land, the alligator capital of the world. Please remain seated till the buggy comes to a complete stop. And guys, do me a personal favor. Leave all your belongings on the buggy. We uh, go through those later. It's time to make our tip money right here. And if you did have fun today, can I get a round of applause for your crazy driver, Caitlin? <laughs> Now please do watch your step all the way out. I'm gonna leave you folks with some part words as my sweet granny used to tell me. So we've just come off of the Stomping Gator off-road adventure. I'm never going to remember that without a sign behind me. That was so, so much fun. Our tour guide and driver were fantastic. It's kind of like the Jungle Cruise at Disney, but on land and so much better. There was loads of air time. It was like bunny hopping. We were going all over the place with just a little seat belt on. I came out of my seat a couple of times. Harry um, got a bit good interaction. They were going to throw you over the fence, weren't they, at one point to open yeah. the gate. He was willing, he was going to do it. Um, but yeah, an absolutely brilliant experience. It was definitely worth the, the money that we paid to go on there. Highly, highly recommend it if you come to Gatorland.